just on my way in to film a video. And I think we got a possum right here in the tree. Look at this guy. Yeah. They're not dangerous. They look scary, but... Let them climb back up. Pretty neat. There's the wildlife we've seen for today. We'll leave them alone. Yeah, that's pretty neat, guys. So, I'm out here today, and uh, it's about time I build myself a bush camp. So, that's what we're out here doing. I'm gonna go back to the spot where I'd film my uh, uh, show us your steak challenge video, and uh, we're gonna set up probably like a lean-to and add a whole bunch of stuff eventually to that so once we get to that spot figure out where we're gonna set everything up and yeah should be pretty fun episode one building a bushcraft camp Andrew on the go headquarters I'll be able to practice all my uh, cooking and stuff like that practice up fire starting and uh, redeem myself with that bacon too. So yeah, let's get to that spot. guys I think we found the spot I moved in a bit from the water because uh, the water's up a bit high and I think if I built where I wanted to it'd probably just get uh, washed away so we found this little spot by this big dead tree here that's not going nowhere that won't fall so yeah, I'll make a spot somewhere around here. So I'm going to explore for a second and get everything figured out. What do you think, Toby? Rubbing in the sawdust there? Huh. All right. After uh, careful planning, and I uh, got a well thought out structure of what I want to do. So I'm going to use that pole, or that tree there, and that tree with my coat. I'm going to use that for the two support trees for the lean-to, and uh, I'll attach the, the ridge pole there. I'll start with that, but I think I'm going to clear up this all this section here. So when I'm standing in my lean-to, or sitting in it, I'll look out and I'll have all this space here. You know, endless possibilities here. I might make like a loft up there, something like a crow's nest. That's yeah, gonna be pretty cool. So I'm gonna start by clearing all this out. Get all that out of the way. You gonna help, Toby? There's already some nice sized poles here. Too. Today for my cutting tools I just got my cheap Baco folding saw Then I got my sweet uh, vintage Wetterlings hatchet so I'm just going to take out one of the small dying tree. There's a lot of dead stuff in this area. Watch out Toby. one and then one at the back oh, 
Ah, right in the eye. All right, so I got this spot all cleaned up. And now I gotta find uh, a ridge pole, nice solid one. I'll get that all tied up and then from there, start gathering all my uh, pulls for the lean-to. But yeah, I like this spot so far. I've seen a lot of uh, deer poop coming in, so maybe I'll see some deer out here. I've seen that possum, so seems like a good little spot. So we'll get us a ridge pole. All right, guys, we got a ridge pole there. We'll get that strung up. Nice piece, nice solid piece. We'll get that all strung up. All right, we're gonna use this uh, camo paracord. Kind of blend in with the, the nature a bit. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna stick this side in there. And I'll, uh, I'll tie that up. Maybe a little higher. Yeah. Toby's going crazy with my work glove over there. So I'll just get this all tied up. Just going to tie the sheet out of it. I'll show you what I got after. Come on, man. Give me my paracord. Oh. oh, man. This guy loves paracord. We got some work to do, bud. Got the ridge pull all set up. Time to do the traditional uh, hang test and see if it holds my weight. If anything, the board's gonna break. Oh yeah. All right, so now I'm just gonna gather up all my poles and uh, start to make the lean-to. Gonna need a bunch of poles. Good thing there's a bunch of dead wood everywhere, so it should be pretty easy. Yeah. Oh. All right, as you can see, I got a bunch of dead, dead wood here, dead trees that fall, and uh, yeah, I just been gathering them up. I'm gonna need way more than this, but you know what? I'm actually losing daylight, so hopefully we get most of the lean-to up today. Or else episode one's gonna be. Uh, half a lean-to build. Well, yeah, this is a great spot. Lots of potential here with this uh, big dead tree behind me. It's going to be great. Great spot to do some cookouts. To learn a lot of stuff and hang out with the dogs and bring the kids out here. So yeah, let's get these all set up. Face them out and fill in all the gaps. Get most of it looking like a lean to, anyways. The ones that are too short, I'm going to use for my sidewalls and stuff. Somewhat starting to look like a lean to. There we go. Got all the poles set up for today, anyways. I'm going to show you what I got.
<laughs> there she is. It's pretty much just the structure of a lean-to. But, you know, I kind of got my uh, boundaries kind of set up. I might make uh, some of these bigger logs down here into seeding. There's that big tree that kind of I seen the big dead tree and I kind of walked over to it and it had like this nice little opening to it. So this is where I'm going to make my bush camp. The 2019 bush camp anyway. So we make a new one every year or just keep adding to this one. But it seems like a pretty good spot. A lot of wildlife. I'm right next to the river down there so you might be able to hear that in the background. But uh yeah, it's getting kind of late, so I think uh, I'm going to have a coffee and just hang out. And then we'll hike out of here. And we'll be back. We'll be back later. Get this up quick before the snow comes. Coffee time. Alright guys, I brought the mana bottle again. And I also brought a cup. Because last time... It was so hot, I couldn't even drink it. It was like boiling water, so I'm just going to dump the coffee in the cup and let it cool down. That's how we're going to do this. The first cup of coffee out at the bush camp. These mana bottles, they were great. My wife got it from a friend. For Christmas, and I kind of claimed it. Alright, guys. I think that's it for episode one on my uh, bush camp here. A little slow start, but the main thing was I found the spot and I got um, some sort of structure set up already, so. When I come out next time, it's going to be a lot more cutting, a lot more everything. So it'll, it'll look like a decent lean-to setup on episode two. This one is off to a little slow start. I had I didn't go uh, where I did my show us your steak video. I, I had to hike in a bit, find this spot, but it seems to be a lot better spot now. And uh, I'm going to go home and take all the birds that take all the burrs out of Toby and uh, but first thing I'm going to finish my coffee yeah that's it for episode one not much to it like I said but get outdoors enjoy life make a bush camp somewhere uh, yeah and just enjoy the winter time because it's coming the snow melted already but it's coming back Right, Toby? All right, guys, see you later. Well, good enough for today, right, Toby? Let's go. See you guys in episode two.